Oh, hey guys! It's been a while! Um, let's just say that I've had a really tough time trying to get this game recorded recently, but thankfully I'm roughly back on target now, so we should be okay to go for a bit more. <laughs> About bloody time, if you ask me. So, uh, where was I last time? I believe last time I started on half of Joe's story, and now I'm in the second half. So, uh, yeah. I can't really choose my teammates as it is. I'm really hoping that my um, L button's not, you know, now working and that I can get my Digimon to Digivolve whenever I friggin' feel like it, not get them to do it for another team member. Oh well. I'm hoping that the graphics look a little bit sharper with the approach that I've taken. I, I, I did a bit of tweaking. Can't guarantee it, but you never know what it's going to turn out like when you upload it to YouTube. So basically, to catch up on the plot, Joe is... Um, basically, uh, they arrived at this place, Tai and Matt, or Tai Chi and Yamato, depending on what you prefer to call them. They argued about whether they should climb the mountain or not. And Joe got involved. Probably shouldn't have done, but he did. Um, anyway, now he's decided, like a silly boy, to climb the mountain all on his own. I genuinely did not know that throwing shit at you stopped you from using your special attacks. <laughs> okay. <coughs> so, um, yeah, like I said, Joe's kind of um, decided to climb a mountain all on his own. Because this is kind of like a different sort of like overworldy sort of area. They've obviously split Joe's story into two segments, uh, much like they did with Mimi. And, uh,. Can't be fucked about you. I battled the last one because it's been a while and I wanted to get a rough idea of where I was at level wise. But I feel like being a lazy fucker. I don't know why. The only other thing with this is sometimes I've really got to be in the mood if I want to play an RPG, which is. I don't know. It's just one of my uh, more curious aspects. So, uh, occasionally, you know, sometimes I don't play this just because I, I need to be in the mood to play an RPG. You may be wondering well, why start a playthrough if you don't have any intention of finishing. Well, here's the thing, I do intend to finish this. I want to finish this. You know, I was, I was so friggin' excited when they announced this. I was like, oh my god, they've made a T, you know, they've made a video game based on the anime. That I grew up on! Yay! Just a few days. Still a little bit more than that. 
If I remember rightly, this shouldn't take too long to get through. Or at least this section shouldn't take too long to get through. Most of Joe's episode has already pretty much happened in the previous part. So, yeah. So, uh, we have a problem. <laughs> the Black Gears have escaped. Um, this is um, where they've been originating from. And I'm going to be a uh, lazy moo and save real quick because you know what? I, I, I can, okay? <laughs> it's been a while and I want to save. I want to make sure that I'm prepared for what I'm going in for. I don't know, did I miss anything? I could have missed something. I'll double check. There's nothing... No, there is nothing down here. I thought for sure there might have been, but no. Okay, that's fine. Well, I haven't missed anything. That's good. That's double good. Double, double, double good. Give me item. No, I don't want to wait you. Leave me alone. Yeah, you look sad now, don't you? You look sad. You look sad. <laughs> God, I feel like a meanie. Oh, God. I don't want to battle you, especially not. Go away! I'll have this, thank you. Really don't want to battle a, a champion level with, with only Gomamon. That would be a bit stupid. I probably should be taking the opportunity to grind wherever I can. It's just I'm, I'm so goddamn lazy. It's going to bite me on the arse later on, I'm sure of it. When I first played, like, when I first tackled um, some of the uh, earlier stages with, uh, you know, particularly the one with Yamato and you had to go and pick up the blue sparkly food, I didn't know what I was fucking doing and uh, I ended up doing a ton of grinding, so I thought I had to beat Monochrome on. But, yeah. This is uh, where things get interesting. Unimon. If anyone's watched the anime, then you'll probably already know what's going to happen. Um, is there anything over here? Real quick. No. Gomamon stops you from going that way. Okay, so... You want to head down here towards Unimon to trigger the next cutscene. I don't think there's any ranking up to be do done in this um, part. Or at least not this particular episode. I haven't got anything written down for it in any case, that's probably... No, I haven't got anything written down, so I'm pretty sure that I don't need to rank up until, like, the next part. Okay. So, uh... It's morning now, the rest of the kids are waking up and they're like, Oh! Joe's gone missing, so... You know that they, they kind of have to come and uh, come and get me, so to speak. Shut up, Sora. Thank you. <laughs> You're cool and all, but crikey, do, do these kids go on, or is it just me? See, I think she's just realised that Joe's just fucked off up the mountain without them. <laughs> what an idiot! So, the rest of the kids wake up, and they're like, well, what the fuck are you going on about? And that Sora's like, oh, well, Joe's just ran off up the mountain without us. <laughs> it's you two's fault, because you had to be idiots and argue. Oh, and they're, they're arguing again. <laughs> oh, no, they're not. Okay. Again, still can't understand Japanese. <laughs> so... I don't know if in the anime Tai Chi comes up Tai Chi and Sora go after Joe. Um I'm pretty sure it's the same deal here. I don't think choosing Tai Chi on Yamato in an argument will affect anything. Oh shit. We've got one mad, angry flying horse looking at us. 
Okay, so because of who I chose in the argument, Yamato actually came up instead. Which completely goes against the anime, because in the anime it was Tai Chi that came up. So obviously I definitely did rank up wrong. <laughs> well actually, there, there is no right or wrong with ranking up. But I did mean to rank up with uh, Tai Chi and not Yamato. But yeah, as it is, no, Yamato's come up instead. It doesn't make a difference, mind. The first time I tried this level, um, I actually did get it right and Tai Chi came up with Sora. I was hoping to keep it true to the anime, but you know what? Who the fuck cares? Who the fuck cares? <laughs> this is just awesome. So, Joe's now going to be an idiot. Of course. Under the guise of responsibility. And of course, we now finally unlock the Digivolution for Gomamon. Here comes the opportunity for me to see if the bloody, um... Oh. To see if the R button's gonna work for me or if I'm gonna have to spend this entire playthrough just, you know, lumping my way through however I can with other techniques. See, this is a Kakumon. Big fucker, isn't he? <laughs> but it's a good kind of big. So, another battle. Another compulsory battle, should I say. It's not quite, um, you know, just your average Numamon battle. This is actually a proper battle. Duh. Why am I even feeling, need, feeling the need to say this? <laughs> so, Unimon, bring it on, bitch. I'm going to use this one. I think that's Harpoon Tawny. Yeah, Harpoon, Harpoon Torpedo. Yay, the L button's working again. I can digivolve. Thank you, PSP. And I will uh, use that attack on you. Oh, I'm so relieved the button's working again. I was panicking the, the last time I recorded this. Like, oh my god, it's not working. This is the worst thing that could possibly ever happen to me. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> so, um, let's see what the second move does. Okay. Um, I'm just reminding myself now. Any attack will do. It'll do. It will bring him down either way. Why the hell is it aiming for Bergamon? What is your problem with Bergamon? <laughs> oh. Try this one. And let's try this one. Okay, this move um, is a stat boosting move. Okay. Okay, I'll take that. <laughs> Got to have to bear that one in mind and look up what it does. Probably, it probably does say, but I'm just being ignorant. Let's get this guy finished off now. Uh, I'm not in the mood to keep hanging around. Just uh, use the powerful attacks that I have. Okay, now it's aiming for Guru Rizman. Not quite sure. Seems like its attack patterns are rather random. But that takes care of that. Unimon has fallen. And uh, we now have a Kakumon on side. So that's, that's fantastic. That's great. I'm happy about that. Excellent. I can't believe that Gomamon's a whole level behind. Maybe I should have done some grinding. That's just sheer laziness on my part. Okay. I'm going to have to make sure that I definitely rank up with Tai Chi next time with Joe. 
If not, I'll just have to kind of... Uh, what I'll just do is I'll uh, make sure I save right before. That should ensure a rank up with Tai Chi. That is if a situation comes across like this again. I don't know if it does. <laughs> I should be okay. We'll see how I go. Should be able to rock and roll just fine. I think it's as long as the characters have like 35 points upwards on their friendship ranking, we should be fine. Anyway, time for the next episode. Tai Chi's in charge. Um, I'll keep Gaiman on in the party because I'm probably going to need... He, he needs levelling up. Um, oh, um, fuck it. Yeah, I'll have Palmon. I'm tempted to put Patamon in the party just because basically Patamon takes forever um, and before it'll be able to evolve. So uh, I don't really want to, you know, its levels to lag or anything. I don't know if that, that comes into play. Anyway, this is uh, this is the next episode. I believe that I get to rank up with Izzy in this episode, or Koshiro, whatever the hell you want to call him. Mimi is such a whiny cunt. <laughs> oh, Eve. So, uh, yeah, I do apologise again for the PSP being noisy, but that's the PSP for you. That's good. Soren, Joe rank up. Um, I'm going to have a look at the rankings or whatever it is. Um, how do I do it again? I've forgotten. I'm sure it's in here. I'm sure that this is how we how we do it. God, I've forgotten how to do it. <laughs> this could be a while. Oh, here we go. <laughs> it was in the wrong fucking menu. <laughs> My own fault. Sorry about that. Um, let's see. Okay. Yamato's doing especially well with Joe. That's good. Sora's ranked up to five with Joe, so as long as she ranks up to five with all of the other characters, she's on target to... Um, for um, her, for her Digimon to reach Mega level, because so I think it's roughly 35 you have to reach before um, they'll be able to Digivolve to Mega. Joe definitely needs to rank up with Tai Chi. Definitely, <laughs> that last episode would have been a fantastic chance to get him on target with Tai Chi, get him up to a three. But never mind. Um, we're doing good. We're good doing. We're doing quite good. Um, uh, is there any items that I can slap on you guys? Right, not you. I'm not sure what's going to be appropriate for whom. Thinking that this one will probably be a good one for you. Um, you are shaped like that, so go with you. I don't. I'm probably sticking on like really stupid choices here, but I kind of, I kind of want to make sure that none of my, none of nobody gets missed out, if you will. 
we'll, see, we'll see how that goes. I mean, it's probably just a random thing. Let's move on. Well, that was a quick battle. <laughs> Goblin one's up to level 11. Oh my god. Really, really steaming ahead there. <laughs> Definitely gonna have to get my other guys caught up. Actually, do some grinding. <laughs> well, that didn't take long. Um, <laughs> literally, that Kawagamon fell extremely quickly. Um, but yeah, I do apologise for like the, the constant cutting out of the uh, grinding sessions that I'm having to do. But I really don't want my team to be under leveled um, by too much. Okay. Another Kawagamon. Here we go. Okay. That one was easy. <laughs> Palmon's up to level 10. That's awesome. So I think I might switch Palmon out for um, Tentamon so I can get Tentamon's levels up to 10 as well. Seems like a sensible approach. At least, at least to me it does. So, uh... Swap Tentamon in. Okay. Anything over here? Okay, this is where I need to go, so what the hell am I asking that for? Oh, Monochromon! And an item! Ooh, I'll definitely do that. <laughs> okay, so two Monochromon and a Kuwagamon. That should have netted me quite a ton of experience. And it has, so thankfully, uh, that's good. So uh, let's move on again. Sometimes that's all we're doing. <laughs> Hopefully, I will find a save point because. Uh... Well, actually, no. I might be able to. Um... Just get Agamon and all that some SP back. I'll have wasted my time if I go up there and find a, a save point. Oh fuck, it's only Kawagamon. If it was a Monochromon, I would go for it, but no, not Kawagamon. Kawagamon goes down too quickly. I don't think it gives me enough experience either. Okay, so we're near enough at the top of where we need to be. Um, oh, there is a save point. I did waste my fucking time with this, uh, using that SP item. I hope I don't regret it. So now we're at the top of the mountain, and we're all like, oh, oh, there's, there's nothing here. Climbed all the way up to the top of this mountain, and there's absolutely fuck all here. <laughs> You're on an island. Oh, and that's basically what the kids find out, that's about it. <laughs> we're on an island. We're never going to get home. <laughs> I'm stuck here forever! Ha <laughs> ha Anyway, cutscene. Liamon, just want to set the scene here, it was actually a good Digimon. Um, out for justice and all that. Then there's Ogamon there, who is a bit of a prick. Basically fights on his own damn side and does whatever's good for him. Bit of a coward. These two are rivals. Um, they're always at each other's throats. Um, which is obviously the this, this scene that's kind of been set up here. And I do apologise if I'm cutting off before the uh, Digimon have finished speaking, but I can't hear at the moment. Anyway, these two um, end up being interrupted in their fight. By none other than the evil Devimon. Devimon is an evil prick, and he looks so short there. <laughs> he's supposed to be much taller than those two, and he's just like such a fucking midget. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Dinky Devimon. 
Oh, you gotta feel sorry for him. Being roughly the same height as Ogamon and Leomon just kind of takes the threatening edge off of him somewhat. Anyway, Devimon is trying to get these two to work for him. Ogamon's happy to do so because, well, he's just going where his, you know, his own interests lead. But Leomon's a good guy, so um, Leomon ends up being put under an evil curse by um, um, Devimon. So. Now Leomon's technically evil as well, even though he's not, because Devimon did it to him, and he's not acting as he normally would. So, upon finding that they're on an island, the kids are just kind of like, yeah. <laughs> I actually did not realise I had to move then. Um, let me see. I think Kushira I need to rank up with. Um, and that is option one, if I remember rightly. I could be wrong. If I'm right, then... Oh, I'm right. Okay, so I was roughly the right sort of area. I don't think I need to rank up with any of the others, though. I think it was only Kushiro. I'll be a bit, bit stumped if, if I have to rank up with any of the others, because it'd be like, okay, but... But, 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 but... <laughs> but, 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 but... My sheet of paper says to only rank up with Kushiro. <laughs> okay, so far, um, yeah, Kushiro was the only one I needed to rank up with, um, and that is option one. So they disappear. I actually thought that me standing there for a minute and was just kind of like a cut scene, and then it was like, no, okay. Oh, uh, look, I'm tempted. I'm tempted. Oh. You I wasn't tempted by you, Mushroom on. Oh, I was tempted by the Monochrome on. The Monochrome on are awesome. Okay, goody. Both of those two have leveled up. So, uh, what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to finish this part off here. And I'll see you guys in the next part. See you later.